Construction is running ahead of schedule for the China-based rail car manufacturing facility in Springfield. 22 News reporter David McKay has where the project is now and when it's expected to be complete. Well, we're about two years away from seeing rail cars roll out onto the test tracks also being put in off of Page Boulevard in Springfield. Construction is ahead of schedule for a $95 million rail car manufacturing facility being put in off of Page Boulevard in Springfield. I've seen a lot of progress. The company building the facility, China Railroad Rolling Stock Corporation, or CRRC, has been contracted by the state to manufacture 284 subway cars for the MBTA, 132 for the red line, and 152 for the orange line. Once completed, the 204,000 square foot facility will employ about 150 workers. The first railroad cars will be delivered in 2018. The Chinese company has faced scrutiny after 55 U.S. Congress members signed a letter asking the U.S. Treasury Secretary to investigate their dealings. Those who signed the letter said the CRRC has used money from the Chinese government to win contracts in Boston and Chicago, beating out competition by huge margins. The contract with Massachusetts was about $200 million below the original estimate, according to Transportation for Massachusetts. Nevertheless, the $566 million deal moves forward, and local businesses are hoping for a trickle-down effect. And I'm hoping that it'll bring more jobs to Springfield and help out people from here in Springfield because it's about community and building up the community. The pay for the average CRRC worker is expected to be $66,000 a year. On Thursday, Governor Charlie Baker will sign the final piece of steel being hoisted into place for the new building. 20 News will have full coverage of the governor's visit to the facility tomorrow on air and online at WWLP.com. David McKay, 22 News.